As you make your bed, you must lie there. And no one cares what you do. And if someone should kick, then it's me, boy. And if someone is kicked, well, then it's you. As you make your bed, you must lie there. And no one cares what you do. And if someone should kick, then it's me, boy. And if someone is kicked, then it's you. Good morning, it's Wednesday the 11th of November and um, that was one of my favourite Kurt Weill songs from Kurt Weill and Bertolt Brecht's 1930 opera um, The Rise and Fall of the City of Mahagoni. Um, very shortly after that of course they um, fled Berlin because it wasn't um, a good place to be Jewish and communist. Um, at the time. Um, so they said goodbye to Berlin. Goodbye to Berlin was of course the title of Christopher Isherwood's 1939 story about his time in Berlin in the early 30s um, and this was adapted in 1951 into a very successful play um, I Am a Camera by John Van Druten. John Van Druten who wrote wonderful plays like I Remember Mama and Bell, Book and Candle, and of course directed the first Broadway production of The King and I. Um, he was an English writer. Anyway, um, it, this play, I Am a Camera, was very successful, won the Tony for Julie Harris, who then starred in the movie adaptation. And of course it wasn't long before people thought this would make a great musical. And the first person to think that was Sandy Wilson. Sandy Wilson, of course, who wrote book, music and lyrics for The Boyfriend. And he was working on his musical, to be called Goodbye to Berlin, when he suddenly realised that the rights to I Am A Camera had been bought up by Harold Prince. So um, Sandy went to Harold Prince and his book writer Joe Masteroff and played them his score um, for the projected Goodbye to Berlin musical. Um, Hal and Joe didn't quite think it was what they wanted and so they moved on, of course, to Candor and Ebb, who provided their score for what was to be the great hit cabaret but um sandy was always quite regretful about this felt he'd done some of his best work um on goodbye to berlin felt very at home with the berlin milieu as you can imagine um he loved um sophisticates and sexual degenerates so um he wrote some fine songs and this is this is one of them oh sally i suppose that we'll look back on this moment in Berlin when the outlook seemed so black and the times were pretty thin and we'll say to think we stood it what a ghastly time we had then we'll reminisce and you'll tell me Chris now after all it wasn't so bad when I'm a bestseller and you're a star Driving round in a great big car We'll think of today and we'll say Ha ha, it might have been worse And when we're out riding in Rotten Row Cutting dead all the dupes we know We'll think of today and we'll say Hey ho, it might have been worse when we're nibbling caviar in a Monte Carlo bar Got out in a full yachting rig We'll remember with a sigh Bygone days when you and I Were happy with a prairie oyster and a sig And when we're as famous as we can be Fairly rolling in LSD 
that's pounds, shilling and pence. We'll look at each other and say he, he. It might have been so much worse. When you're in your suite at the Ritz Hotel, telling Goldwyn to go to hell, you'll think of today and you'll say, well, well, it might have been worse. When I'm in my mansion on Ilkley Moor, swapping stories with Sure, I'll think of today and I'll say, hoo, hoo, it might have been worse at your latest premiere when I meet you on the stair with Adolf Monjou and Tom Mix. We'll remember with a choke bygone days when we were broke and thankful for an evening at the local flicks. I'll send out for a case of mum And you'll look at me and we'll say Ho-hum It might have been so 